Many people dream of being wealthy in some fashion, mainly because they want to go and get just about anything they want, or live in a massive mansion, and so on and so forth. But while there are plenty of millionaires out there, and even billionaires out there, there are only a select few that have reached a level to where they can say they're some of the richest people on the entire planet. These are the people who have broken through in business and beyond to rake in the money. But who are the top dogs? Allow us to show you the top 8 richest people in the world as of 2021. Be sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel. Number 8. Mukesh Ambani Mukesh Ambani is an Indian business magnate, currently chairman, managing director, and largest shareholder of Reliance Industries Limited RIL. His various dealings in Asia have made him the richest man on the continent in certain years, including 2021, depending on which net worth gauge you look at. He's also a man who is never afraid to go and flex his wealth. For example, he spent $2 billion on a mega mansion in India that is, in fact, the largest home in the world today. Why? Because he can. And having over $79 billion in net worth means you can do a lot. Number 7. Larry Ellison Here's a name you're all likely to know in one form or another. Larry Ellison is the co-founder of the Oracle Corporation, and he was also the company's CEO until September 2014. Over the years, Oracle has become an incredibly successful tech company, now being 39 years old and employing over 136,000 people. Tech companies like his are constantly growing in various fashions, which is why his net worth basically grows with every year that passes. As of 2021, he's worth almost $90 billion. Number 6. Warren Buffett A name that is synonymous with wealth, Warren Buffett is a guy so smart in how to invest that even pro athlete LeBron James went to him for advice on how to invest his millions. That's name recognition right there. If you somehow don't know, Warren Buffett is an American entrepreneur and investor and CEO of Berkshire Hathaway. Buffett is the most successful investor worldwide, and millions of other traders look up to him because of his success, which is well-deserved and completely on the up and up. What's more, unlike a previous entry, Buffett doesn't feel the need to live luxuriously as he lives in a house that he got before he was ever a billionaire. And yet now, he's worth $92 billion. Number 5. Mark Zuckerberg The story of Mark Zuckerberg is one that is known to many for various reasons, not the least of which is the film The Social Network, which told a dramatized version of the creation of Facebook. An idea that Zuckerberg came up with, kind of, and then took to the highest levels possible, so much so that his social media site has gotten him a net worth of over $109 billion. Yeah, he did that. Granted, it hasn't always been easy. Mark Zuckerberg has regained the significant net worth loss he suffered after the Cambridge Analytica data scandal and various other issues causing the Facebook stock prices to fall. Plus, he might actually be the most hated billionaire on this list because of how he absolutely sold out to certain ad companies and potentially other nations in order for them to have more access to users via ads and such, versus just keeping Facebook a place for people to interact. Regardless of his lovability, Zuckerberg is a boss and has the net worth to prove it. Number 4. Bill Gates Yeah, you all likely knew that he was going to be on this list, and for all the right reasons. Bill Gates is the creator of Microsoft. He made it in 1975 with Paul Allen and has since become the largest PC software company worldwide. Even though not all PCs, personal computers, are from Microsoft, his company very much inspired pretty much all that the other PC companies do. They weren't even the first to make a personal computer, but they did make one that was affordable unlike rival Apple at times, and would benefit those who wanted to work and play and interact on such a device. And of course, they have gone and expanded their reach into other areas, including making the Xbox video game console and developing VR technology, among other things. At one point in time, Bill Gates was the richest man in the world for several years. But even though he's not top dog anymore, having $133 billion in net worth is still very impressive. Number 3. Bernard Arnault. At first, this is a name you might not recognize, but when you hear what he does, you'll understand why he's currently worth over $157 billion. Bernard Arnault is the CEO of LVMH, Louis Vuitton Moet Hennessy. Ultimately, the company was formed by merging the two businesses. Louis Vuitton is a very successful luxury fashion brand, as many of you likely know. 
In Malay, Hennessy is the merged champagne and cognac manufacturers. Bernard has been making serious movements up this list in the past year or so. In fact, at the beginning of 2017, he was at 14th. Now, almost four years later, he's placed at third on the list of the 25 richest people on earth in 2021. And it's not hard to see why. Louis Vuitton is one of the top fashion brands in the world. It's a brand made for those who want luxury clothes and people are willing to spend money to get it, which means his value continues to go up and up and up. Number two, Elon Musk. You might recall that Elon Musk was the richest man in the world in the late parts of 2020 and the early parts of January in 2021. He even broke the $200 million mark on the net worth scale at one point. But recent events involving SpaceX, Tesla, and apparently some Bitcoin investments have made it so that his stock, in terms of net worth, dropped by a whopping $15 billion. Talk about a bad day. But even with that fall, which he can easily get back as he's done so in the past, Elon Musk is worth over $180 billion, and that's nothing to frown at. Not unlike the number one entry on our list, Elon's net worth in 2020 boomed in major ways. The two biggest ways, though, was that Tesla, the electric car company he's CEO of, continued to crank out cars at a profit and the desire for a Tesla car has never been higher. What's more, his space company and SpaceX had multiple successful missions in 2020 that helped prove that his pet project, if you will, is going to help put people into space once again very soon. The reason for the fluctuations with his net worth is that a lot of his wealth is based on his company's stocks. When they do well, he'll be number one. When they dip, like very recently, he'll still be number two. Still, Elon Musk is a genius, even if it's a crackpot genius. And he's going to keep pushing things forward for himself and his companies. And regardless of where his net worth is, he's going to keep building, expanding, creating, and pushing the bounds of where humanity can go. Number one, Jeff Bezos. Yes, Jeff Bezos is back on top of the money world as of very recently. Because as noted, Elon Musk took the top spot in January of this year, but in late February, Tesla stocks took a fall and he lost enough net worth for Jeff Bezos to reign supreme once again. Jeff Bezos is the founder of Amazon, one of the biggest and most popular companies on the web. Amazon started as a simple online bookstore in Jeff's bedroom, and the initial sales were slow. But after expanding his craft and what his site sold, he found himself with a business that was literally raking in money left and right. Fast forward to now, and Amazon is the place to go and get things online. No other site compares. The irony of Bezos' wealth as it stands right now is that two major events should have crippled him in his worth. The first was the divorce from his wife Mackenzie, as she took a solid chunk of both his personal wealth and 4% of stocks in Amazon. But also, the 2020 pandemic should have made it so people didn't have the money to buy things on his site. But the opposite was true. Due to everything being locked down and unable or unwilling to go physically to stores, Suddenly, Amazon was the place to go and shop for everything you needed to survive the pandemic. His net worth boomed in 2020, and as of 2021, it hovers over $188 billion, thus allowing him to once again say he's the richest man in the world. And for the foreseeable future, he'll always be at least in the number two spot as long as Amazon keeps getting used. So what do you think? What do you think of this look at the richest people in the world and how they stack up to one another? Were you surprised at some of the entries on this list? Or where a certain person placed on this list despite their fame and clear wealth? Do you think the top two spots will continue to swap back and forth over the course of 2021? Let us know in the comments below, be sure to subscribe, and we'll see you next time on the channel.